Hey everybody, I'm doing a quick VR for Brian over at Hodges 1455. Brian asked, show me some good hitting pitchers. Who do you think of when you think of a good hitting pitcher? And instantly I think most of us go, well, clearly it's Babe Ruth, even though he didn't pitch for most of his career. When he was pitching, he was lights out and he was smacking the ball. Amazing. And now I think most kids are like, babe, who? There's this guy named Shohei and he's really good. But I'm like, Shohei, isn't he a $700 million DH? Uh, I don't know that he counts as a pitcher, um, but maybe that's just the way I think. So, but who I think of, and I don't know that a lot of people will instantly go to this person, is Madison Bumgarner. <clears throat> now, I don't have a lot of really cool Mad, Mad Bum cards, but I do have this one from 09. This was part of the TriStar set. Uh, I used to get those a lot because they had autographs. I, I was always hunting for autographs. And I actually had a Mad Bum autograph from the set at one point, but I no longer have it in my collection. So let's talk about old Mad Bum a little bit. Um, Four-time All-Star from 13 through 16. Three-time World Series champion, 2010, 12, and 14. I tried to forget the 2010 year because that was the year that they kicked out the Texas Rangers. Um painful. Still have flashbacks from the game we went to, and I'm probably still paying off uh, my credit card debt from that game. So, but I digress. World Series MVP in 2014, NLCS MVP 2014, two-time Silver Slugger 14 and 15, Babe Ruth Award in 14, uh, et cetera, et cetera. Um, played for the Giants from 9 to 19. I think that's where, at least that's where I think of. I think of Giants Mad Bum, but he's been playing in Arizona. Rumor has it he might retire this year. Sounds like he doesn't want to retire, but I think he might be getting forced into retire in retirement. Uh, but that's all his pitching stuff. Is, but he was a lights-out pitcher for five years. Very, very good. But what always caught my attention was when he was hitting dingers. He was not a guy you could mess around with when he was pitching. I think usually when I think of the NL before the DH rule, I think that ninth slot is a joke. Why are they doing it? I used to argue with my National League friends, fan friends who were like, it's the way baseball's supposed to be you know, played. And I'm like, it's an automatic out almost always. If it wasn't, then uh, managers wouldn't substitute and put in a, 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 an outfielder or whatever, or an infielder spare, and switch up pitchers again. I mean, there's the managers know it, the fans know it. Why are you even arguing with me? But either way, I digress. Mad Bum, who was awesome. Let's talk about some numbers real quick that you might find interesting. Um, we are talking about great, good hitting pitchers. And I am not going to be talking about for average, but here's some interesting numbers that I think of. And again, I have mental images of him hitting home runs, uh, which is very fun. Uh, 313 games uh, at the plate from 09 to 21. Uh, 731 plate appearances accredited with 633 ABs. Here's where it gets interesting. He had a 172 batting average. Not not great. Uh, but he had 109 hits. You're like 109 hits at six, it was 633 ABs isn't great, but he had 19 home runs. You're like, all right, so he's a pitcher who hit 19 home runs. You realize if he hit the ball 17% of the time, it's a home run. And he's your pitcher. So uh, I know there are better hitting pitchers out there. Uh, certainly some historic Historically good people who could, pitchers who could also bat. Um, but he is, he's just the one I think of. I know it's random. I know not everybody thinks of Mad Bum. And maybe it's because of that Texas Rangers run in 2010 where I paid attention closely to the Giants and uh, it was painful. So maybe, maybe I think of Mad Bum because secretly I hate him. <laughs> I don't know. So I hope you enjoyed it. I know it was it was just a quick one. I just thought it was fun. So if you haven't seen any uh, Mad Bum home run clips, 
Uh, I probably have some right in this general area that I've been streaming. That's what I was thinking about doing. Uh, since you only hit 19, uh, I thought maybe I wonder if I can get through all 19 home runs. But I might get copywritten. So if it's not up there right now, it's because uh, YouTube said, no, sir, you did not take that film on your cell phone and uh, you do not have permission to use it. But if it is there, look at that dude. He's awesome. Uh, that's it. So I really appreciate it. Uh, go check out Brian. And again, thank you so much. Um, this was fun. So I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.